What is up guys, your boy We will here back with another video. I am psyched today, why? Because I have found out that one of the super rare variants in the 2012 Collector's Tins will be Wind Up Zen Mains. That is a really good decision by Konami, and I take back what I said in my previous video regarding Dolka being a pointless re-release. Paired with Zen Mains, they are the two perfect re-releases. The only thing left would be Rescue Rabbit, and then people could practically build the entire Rabbit deck. They would just need maybe a couple of Leviers and those Lagias. But it is really good news, and uh, I'm really pleased about it. This essentially makes a list of pretty good re-releases over the past two years. We have the likes of Polyduality Duality and Psalm Warning, for example. And to add to that, Dolphin and Zen Mains is just damn perfect. That is especially considering that originally all these cards were between $80 and $100 a piece. So Konami are really thinking about what to re-release, rather than just re-releasing a bunch of stupid cards like Green Baboon, Defender of the Forest, and Battle Fader, for example, who initially was only a $40 card, which really isn't that much if you wanted to get a play set. Uh, I'm going to be quite forgiving of Konami, uh, apart from their mess up in Haunted Mine, which I think is the worst gold series of all time by far, uh, re-releasing stupid cards and Utopia for like the fourth time. And for people who like these ghost rare things, that's fair enough. But uh, it definitely with the collector's tins, they have definitely done right. Uh, they haven't really done much wrong in this sense. Um, they're making stuff that was originally really difficult to get a lot easier to get, which is essentially the job of collector's tins, or at least the unofficial job. And the other super rare card was Blizzard Princess. and. Another thing that Konami are, seem to be doing is anticipating the release of popular archetypes. Um, like in the next set, uh, Return of the Duelist, there will be a new Book of Spells archetype for spellcasters. And they're anticipating this and re-releasing Blizzard Princess, which may have become difficult to get if people were all building that deck. So that's another good move by Konami. You know, kudos. And I'm going to readily admit that I don't know too much about the deck, but she seems okay. You can attribute one monster to get, it, to get her out at 2800. I mean, that's not too bad and your opponent can activate Spell Traps card, it's kind of like a mini Cold Wave. But unless the deck was sort of an OTK type build, pushing for OTK in one turn, I don't really see it being that effective. So what about the other super rare cards? Do you think Rescue Rabbit will make an appearance? I sincerely hope he does. That would essentially complete the Rabbit deck apart from the Laggies, and as I said, a couple of Leviers perhaps. Uh, but what other cards could we think of? Well, uh, there are the likes of Scrap Dragon, who is still waiting to be re-released. He has not been re-released at all, and he's been out since 2010. It's quite ridiculous and everyone seems to use him, and he's now a $25 card. And we've also got the likes of Wind Up Rabbit. Um, he's going for about $31 on trollandtoad.com, which is the site that I pretty much follow. But yeah, it'd be pretty nice to see him re-release as well, although I don't think it's exactly necessary, but if you're following this whole Photon Shockwave Wind Up theme, why not? So what do you guys think? What would be on the list? As of right now, it is a mystery. Um, I myself think it will be either Rescue Rabbit or Wind Up Rabbit if they're following that whole Photon Shockwave thing. But uh, put some comments in the comment section below if you've got any other ideas of what either you want to be re-released or what you think is likely to be released in these tins. But anyway, that's it for the video today, guys. Just a bit of news, a bit of an update. Um, keep an eye out for my other videos. Uh, post comments, comment rate, subscribe, all that jazz. Uh, this is Weevil, and I am signing out.